Hey everybody, today we're gonna see if my pullout game is strong or not. And I had this come in, my first Pokemon order from somebody on Facebook, which is pretty cool. We're gonna see what we got in here. Is my pullout game strong? No, because this is predetermined. I saw the cards that were gonna come in here, and here we go. Let's see what we got. I just wanted to show you guys. There is a Holographic Energy, a Vicavolt V. And keep in mind, I purchased all of these for 40 bucks. And you tell me if you think it was worth it. Rhyperior V. El Creamy V. Druludon, I think, and this is from Champion's Path. Another one. Lucario. Lucario is awesome. And Piers, full art Piers. Search your deck for an energy card and a dark Pokemon. Reveal them and put them into your hand. So it must be good for dark deck users. And look at that. Uh, Hyper Rare, Rainbow Rare, Pokemon Breeders Nurturing. Man, and it only gets better from here, I think. Guard of War VMAX Rainbow Rear. Check that out. That is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful card. Look at this, all that. Rainbow Shine, I think that is my favorite type of holographic. It's just cool. And then what do we, what do we have after this? Is my pullout game strong? Bang! Butterfree VMAX. Now when I saw this on sale online, um, and for the price for all these cards, 40 bucks, I mean, I just jumped on it. Look at this. And actually, recently I looked at the uh, video gameplay um, for the actual Pokemon game, and it's it's funny how how big these Pokemon grow when they go VMAX. <laughs> and they have like that, that cloud hanging over their heads. Freaking Butterfree. I think this Butterfree is the most valuable card in this singles bundle. And last card. Wow, the Suspicious Food Tin. This was one of the most, was one of the most sought after cards when um, uh, Champion's Path came out. And here it is. It's in my hands. Because the thing is, I don't plan on opening any Champion's Path at all. I don't. Because... Um, Really, as like a, a beginner, I, I'm not jumping straight into like all the Charizards and stuff. I want to collect, I want to do master sets of something that's simpler. And that is why I'm doing Crimson Inv Invasion for the Rainbow Rare Gyarados and Rebel Clash because I like Ninetales too. And there's Ninetales in there. And these packs are. A little special to me because, well, this set, because when I started collecting again after 20 years, this was the set that was, was out. So I'm going to start with this one and create my master set. And it's also cool because this one has the, uh, the starter Pokemon in it, the Galarian starters, like this guy right here, Rillaboom. And my first pull ever. Uh, recently, when I started back up again after 20 years, is actually Toxtricity. Not this one, but it was a full art one. And boy, that was a good feeling. I bought a blister pack, three packs, and um, I got actually two pulls from there. I pulled this guy, full art, and a Sonya full art, which um, I can show you in another video, but um, w when I update you guys on my, my collection, but today, yeah, I just wanted to look at my new collection that I got. Look at that, the Psychic Energies and my new Rainbow Rears. That is beautiful. Sorry if you can't see that. Yeah, Butterfree. Butterfree is a staple Pokemon. It was, I still remember Ash giving away or setting his Butterfree free. Ironic, right? And, uh, yeah, his, his pullout game was was emotional. He had an emotional pullout game on, in, on that episode, man. I know Ash was feeling it. He didn't want to let go. He was in love. 
but he did the right thing and uh, you know what they say if, if you love something let it go and if it comes back then uh, you were meant to be but I don't think he ever got but got Butterfree back so <laughs> there's that but yeah once again Gardevoir Remax Pokemon Breeder Piers one of the coolest Pokemon Lucario Lucario and these guys for 40 bucks do you think it was worth it I think a PSA 10 or at least a 9 will get a lot of of that money back so um, I don't plan on keeping all of the cards from different sets like again I, my plan is to create master sets of certain sets so I, I have a goal and I'm gonna set it and do it and the rest of the cards are kind of expendable unless they're like super rare Charizards or whatnot right which I did pull recently a, 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 a hollow Charizard from XY Evolutions baby but for now, today we have Butterfree. Thanks for watching. If you, if you think my, my pull out game was strong today, let me know. And uh, watch me pull out some more in some future videos.